The Philippine Air Force currently operates 12 FA-50PH light combat aircraft, acquired from Korea Aerospace Industries between 2015 and 2017 for approximately 18.9 billion Philippine pesos. These aircraft have been instrumental in various operations, including the 2017 Marawi siege, underscoring their value in the Philippine Air Force's inventory. However, with evolving security threats, there is a recognized need for more advanced and versatile fighter jets. Korea Aerospace Industries has proposed supplying an additional 12 FA-50 light combat aircraft to the Philippines, a deal valued at approximately 40 billion Philippine pesos, 681 million United States dollars. This acquisition would double the Philippine Air Force's current FA-50 fleet, enhancing its air defense capabilities. Korea Aerospace Industries has recommended retrofitting the current FA-50PH aircraft to support air-to-ground, air-to-sea, and air-to-air -air missions. Proposed enhancements include advanced radar and targeting systems and the integration of 300-gallon external fuel tanks to extend combat range. These upgrades are viewed as cost-effective solutions to achieve a credible air defense posture. The Philippine Air Force is evaluating the South Korean-developed KF-21, Borame, as a potential candidate for its multi-role fighter, MRF, program. The KF-21, currently undergoing development and flight testing, is anticipated to enter full production by 2026. It is designed to evolve into a fifth, sixth-generation fighter with advanced capabilities, offering an affordable lifecycle cost. In October 2024, the Philippines and South Korea elevated their bilateral relations to a strategic partnership, emphasizing increased defense cooperation. This partnership includes support for the Philippines' military modernization efforts, with South Korea expressing readiness to assist in acquiring advanced military assets such as fighter jets and submarines. In response to escalating regional security challenges, particularly in the South China Sea, the Philippines is actively modernizing its military capabilities. A significant aspect of this modernization is the enhancement of the Philippine Air Force's fleet through strategic partnerships, notably with South Korea's Korea Aerospace Industries. This collaboration aims to bolster the Philippine Air Force's operational readiness and territorial defense. The Philippine Air Force has initiated a program to procure 40 new multi-role fighter aircraft to enhance its territorial defense capabilities. The selection process is ongoing, with potential contenders including the KF-21, Lockheed Martin's F-16, and Sweden's Saab JAS-39 Gripen. The government is exploring financing options to support this significant acquisition, reflecting its commitment to modernizing the countries demonstrating its commitment to enhancing operational capabilities and international collaboration, the Philippine Air Force participated in the Pitch Black Multinational War Games in Northern Australia in July 2024. This marked the Philippine Air Force's first overseas deployment of combat aircraft since 1963. The exercise involved 20 countries and 140 aircraft, providing the Philippine Air Force with valuable experience in complex air operations and strengthening its international partnerships. The deepening defense collaboration between the Philippines and South Korea, exemplified by potential acquisitions and upgrades of advanced fighter jets, signifies a mutual commitment to regional security and stability. As the Philippines continues to modernize its military capabilities, Partnerships with nations like South Korea will play a crucial role in addressing evolving security challenges and ensuring the country's defense readiness. Building upon its commitment to bolster national defense, the Philippines is making significant strides in modernizing its military capabilities. Recent developments include strategic acquisitions of advanced aircraft, enhanced training programs, and strengthened international defense partnerships. The Philippine Air Force is set to expand its fleet with the procurement of 12 additional FA-50 light combat aircraft from Korea Aerospace Industries. Valued at approximately 40 billion Philippine pesos, 681 million United States dollars, this acquisition will double the Philippine Air Force's current FA-50 inventory, significantly enhancing its air defense capabilities. The FA-50s have proven their effectiveness in various operations, including the 2017 Marawi siege, underscoring their value into the Philippine Air Force arsenal. To ensure the sustained operational readiness of its F-A-50 fleet, the, the Philippine Air Force has entered into a performance-based logistics PBL, contract with Korea Aerospace Industries. This one-year agreement, valued at approximately 1.1 billion Philippine pesos, 20.4 million United States dollars, encompasses comprehensive maintenance services, technical support, and parts management. 
The PBL framework aims to optimize aircraft availability and reduce lifecycle costs, reflecting a commitment to efficient resource utilization. In its pursuit of advanced air capabilities, the, the Philippine Air Force is evaluating the South Korean-developed KF-21, Borame, as a potential candidate for its multi-role fighter, MRF, program. The KF-21, currently undergoing development and flight testing, is anticipated to enter full production by 2026. Designed to evolve into a fifth, sixth-generation fighter with advanced capabilities, it offers an affordable lifecycle cost, aligning with the, the Philippine Air Force modernization objectives. Recognizing the importance of advanced training, the, the Philippine Air Force has intensified its pilot development programs. Notably, Philippine pilots participated in the Pitch Black Multinational War Games in Northern Australia, marking the, the Philippine Air Force's first overseas deployment of combat aircraft since 1963. This exercise, involving 20 countries and 140 aircraft, provided valuable experience in complex air operations and underscored the, the Philippine Air Force's commitment to regional security. The Philippines continues to strengthen its defense partnerships to support its modernization efforts. In October 2024, the country elevated its bilateral relations with South Korea to a strategic partnership, emphasizing increased defense cooperation. This includes support for the Philippines' military modernization initiatives, with South Korea expressing readiness to assist in acquiring advanced military assets such as fighter jets and submarines. The Philippines is making significant progress in its defense modernization journey through strategic acquisitions, enhanced training programs, and strengthened international partnerships. These initiatives are pivotal in addressing evolving security challenges and ensuring the country's defense readiness in a dynamic regional landscape.